this is going to be a non drop down unboxing of the the Marvel box. I need a sharp implement. This is the latest Marvel box, as I said, and the theme of this one. The theme of this one is Yeah, all right, yeah, Guardians of the Galaxy 2. Um, I definitely think that Marvel was Marvel at the success that Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1, when the first movie had. Um, I liked it, and I didn't read the comics, um, but. Anywho, I definitely like the characters. I like the chemistry of the characters. Uh, so, here you go. If you haven't already watched a million of these, you, it looks like you basically were concentrating on Groot here. He's, he's the star of the show, it seems. Um, you get the typical two pins. Um, comic. Uh, okay, well, this is actually... The next box and then on the back of this is the uh, prototypes and stuff and tells you what's in there so again with this you get a, uh, a comic so here's the comic and you got Groot and Rocket so I actually might be interested in that one I'm not really a comic guy if that just caused a ton of you to tune out, well, what can I do? And this, wow, okay. T-shirt is the exact same colors as the second, no, the last uh, Star Wars box with the Rebels. It's the exact same colors. I mean, I don't care, but if I actually wear this to the gym or something like that. Hmm, whatever. Alright, so. On to the goodies. Uh, it appears we have a rocket with Groot. Where the hell is Groot? Oh, he's on his head. Okay, sorry, I'm looking at this. Alright. So, rocket with Groot. I'll give that a second to focus. I don't know if it is. I hope it is. There's the top. The box is in good condition, so that's nice. Uh, put him to the side, because there's something else in this box here. But, yeah, little, little baby Groot looks like he's on... Uh, riding on Rocket's back this time, instead of the other way around. Maybe it's a play on the first movie when they were in their prison, and Rocket was on... The big guy's back. Okay, this is a Dorb's ride, and wow. Okay, I have never collected a Dorb in my life, um, so that was. I thought I could, I could barely one hand it. Okay, there's nothing else in the box except for some comics. All right, what is this? What is this? This appears to be Star-Lord on his ship. Hmm. Um, the, um, my first thought, the reason I paused is I'm thinking trade bait with the gentleman that owns my local store. So here's uh, the uh, ride, Dorb's ride, smaller than your Funko ride, which was okay, I guess, and then, uh, I guess that's the collection of Dorb's, uh, for this series, 
And again, I don't collect orbs, so I don't know if I'll keep this or not. But the fact that it's an, it's an exclusive, I might be able to trade it. Whenever the Game of Thrones stuff comes out, everywhere I ask, nobody has a clue. No store can give me any ideas when they're coming out. Um, but uh, let me, let's, let's open up the, uh, the pop. Why not, right? Do this somewhat carefully. Because I'm a stickler for boxes. Gently over there. Ah, oh, yeah, that's cool. All right, all right. Here he is. So, if you're curious about how he's mounted, he's right on his head. And little baby Groot. He's got his little tail. Rocket does. And from the from the front, he's got his uh, pistols. Baby Groot is holding on for dear life. That'd be really, I mean, you know what would be really cool? If they actually had a version of this, um, the version of Rocket where he's got the flames underneath him and he's taken off. It'd be pretty cool if they made it, if they combined all three. They put Baby Groot on top of his head and then uh, put the uh, fake uh, fire or blasters. Rocket Pack. Get it, Rocket? Ha, ah, Rocket Pack. Uh, that'd be pretty cool, but yeah, that's pretty badass. I like that because they're definitely both two of my favorite characters of that series. So uh, that is the box, and it looks like now look at that. Maybe you can see. Check out on Rockets. Well, as you look at it to your right, but his left ear. I don't know if you can make that out. It looks like some kind of glue. Maybe that's why it was sticking in the, in the box. Like, yeah, it looks like... Well, okay, yeah, whatever that was, it actually just kind of came off a little bit. Whatever. Um, I don't think he's getting traded anytime soon. So, he's safe. He can't speak for him. You may be out of luck. I wonder if he'll stand up. I feel like he's back heavy. Like, Groot's too much. You can sometimes bend these a little bit. I don't, I'm not... Forgive me, I'm not sure if that's a frame. Okay, there we go. Uh, don't bang. Don't. Uh, this is precarious, so there's way more weight in the head than the body on this figure. So you might need to use one of the little sticky guys, and it doesn't come with a pedestal. So, and he falls right over. Anyway, I um, hope you dug that video. If you were into the whole collecting and pops and unboxing and all that fun stuff. So, I am, <laughs> clearly.